Hello and welcome back to Thuric Place Mortime, City of the Damned. Today I'm going to start in the normal menu because it's the first time I'm starting the game since I have bought the DLC, so the two new classes. And I just want to make sure that everything I see towards these is recorded as well. So let's load up our sisters. And it has been a few days since I've played more time. I think the day of the patch was the last day I actually played the game. It's just that at the initial release of the patch, the DLC wasn't out yet. There was a small delay, so I couldn't record it at that time. But it doesn't really matter. So apparently there's no queue for it, but... We should, I should actually be able to get two smugglers for free. Yes, they are. They cost nothing, so let's get one right away. It's part of the DLC that you get two at the level that is highest uh, of your highest warrior, but not higher than seven. So there's that, and I'm going to buy the one that already does have a ranged weapon equipped. Because I do want to use this one in a ranged fashion. So, can I just hire her? Maybe? Yeah, if I do this, probably. So... There it is. Okay, confirm. And we do have some things to give her here. And I really regret now uh, selling my nice uh, things here, my, my ranged weapons. Let's take a look. What She does have unique skills for herself. And let's check these out real quick. Uh, boarding prowess increases critical hit chance of leap and jump down attacks. Uh, it's pretty situational. After gathering a word stone, increases movement range by 1 meter and initiative by 5. Not stackable. Initiative chain challenges take effect on the next round. It's okay. When another ally is engaged with the same enemy, increase dodge and parry bypass. That's really good, but only for close quarter fighting. That's climbing, which is actually really good if we want to get her into onto, um, high ground. Uh, fencer is for close combat. We do need the ballistic skill here for critical hit chance by... We'll use, oh, that's really good, actually. When engaged with two or more enemies, increase melee critical hit chance by 5%. Okay. So I think we should just start off right away. Let's just go nuts on the ballistic skill. I think. Uh, the other ones I'm not sure yet, so let's just start with that. And get the fine-tuning. So, yeah. Fine-tuning, confirm. And I also want to master that one. And let's take a look at her special active skills. She does have impact shot, ranged attack that deals regular damage and bypasses 15% of the target's armor. Sounds nice. Liquid Courage increases initiative by 10 and the chance to pass all alone tests by 15%. Um, okay. Repost is close combat. Captain's Speech increases the chance to pass all alone fear and terror tests. Not bad. Place a fake search point at target location that explodes when an enemy approaches within 0 0.5 meters, stunning everyone within 5 meters for one turn. And a hand bomb, which bypasses armor absorption. I'm not sure, actually, here. What I think I want to get definitely is some ranged passives, so... I think Quick Reload is actually a good choice here. At least for one, or let's let's check the, the weapon here. Okay, we can't actually... Okay, so we have to spend our remaining skills first. Let's go for... 
well, we don't need, really need strength. We could go for strength, strength 6 to get the additional inventory slot. I think that's okay. Aside from that, probably we can go pretty heavy into agility skills. I don't know if we want to go 15 agility, though. But it might actually be not the worst idea, but let's stick with 12 for now and go for a little bit more toughness. I don't know if that's the correct choice here, but it's the one I'm making and we can go get agility up higher in the end anyways. Um, let's confirm that. Why is there no confirm button back here? Okay, something is apparently wrong. Um. Oh, cancel. Um. Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's check the active skills here. We do have... What kind of shots do we have? Um, the hand shot. Because I, I really don't know anything about the, the ranged skills, actually. And she does have the black powder trap already. Um, and that deals just damage. Okay, hand shot. If hit, the target's chance to hit is decreased. Okay. Knee shot increases initiative, crippling shot decreases offense points. That's valuable. Pinning shot reduces strategy points. Entrenched is for Overwatch, I think. Uh, okay, no, it's it's you allows it. It's a do, uh, mix between dodge and Overwatch apparently. And. Nerf shots, breaks, parry, and web of steel. Nice. Okay, but I think we do want to go for the impact shot first. And let's master that as well. So we have two skill points left, and I think I want to go with quick reload. Okay, so here we are not... Um, let's put some into alertness. Morale is obviously good. And a little bit of intelligence can't hurt for the resistances. So, okay. I'm okay with this. And we did get everything so confirm and she's back here let's take a look oh but she starts with purple stuff so nice <laughs> really wow that's definitely awesome okay she has purple clothing um, let's keep that the hunting rifle as well the reload takes three strategy points, so only two. Yeah, that's nice. And she also has a sword and dagger in purple. Okay, that's pretty awesome. And I do want to try her out, of course, so... Um, it is one more day for our impressive to come back, so that's definitely the perfect time now. Let's switch out Matilda, as she is injured as well, and... We'll switch in Zerihilde. Prasek. Our new smuggler. And before we start, let's take a look at the customization options we have here. Okay, only one style. Yeah, I think I like this one better. Yep, on both of them. Uh, that one, definitely that one. Okay, yeah, and a flute, why not? 
<laughs> and next let's check the presets. We maybe we want to offset her a little bit from our regular look. But these definitely look nice. Let's see. I don't know which one I like best, to be honest, at the moment. They all have something to them. Come on, I need to choose. Yeah, I think this one is good. Okay. So now we finally have a ranged unit. <laughs> a normal one. And no shipment request at the moment. So there's that. Before I start, I want to address something with the impressive real quick. Um, I think it was Scott Smart who comments regularly, who got wondered why the impressive lost damage with the two-handed weapon. Um, apparently, because she's an impressive and human-sized, she still loses the damage each each swing. So I wanted to try her out with a one-handed weapon and shield, but after my match against Morjax, someone on his perspective commented that I should give the impressive two one-handed weapons because those wouldn't reduce the damage she did with each, each swing. And I think that might be... I, I will definitely try it out and uh, it should do... Uh, it's pretty much the same damage as the two-handed weapon, but with the added bonus that I don't lose damage each consecutive swing. So that sounds pretty valuable, and I just wanted to address that real quick. I think it was Dwarf Furious, if I remember correctly. I don't have the name right now, but I think that's it. Who said that? So thanks for that comment. I don't know if you ever watch this, but if you do, thank you, and I will try that out as well. So, with that all said and done, you know what, let's take a quick look in the shop before I do that. Um, clothing of archers, ah, that sounds nice, but... Okay, and what can she actually wear? Because I would really like to get her what weapons I can use, she can use, I, I mean. Because I would like to give her not the, the, one she, the one she's wearing now, but dueling pistols, actually, because I really like those. They'll just look awesome. So we'll have to keep a lookout for, for a pair of those. Um, we need to advance one day. Okay, we could use Abrienda again, but I do want to try out the new one, and I just want to keep them like that. And the rating is kind of skyrocketed here. Let's take a look. Um, okay. I will go for the story mission soon, I think. But not today. And let's see. We have a hard one with average wordstone, a brutal one with average wordstone, or a brutal one with exceptional wordstone. And both warbands are scattered randomly around the area, scared by something. So that's got the potential to be a total disaster. Let's do that one. Exceptional wordstone. I like it. The setup is obviously pretty bad, but... Ah, it's, it's part of the fun. Let's just hope it works out. So I'll be right back with deployment. Okay, obviously not deployment because we're both being scattered randomly. Um, it was just sort of reflex. And we're playing against Sisters of Sigma. So, yay? I don't know. We'll see. Okay, apparently they do have someone with stupidity. Their auger, who just does nothing. No, she's moving. Okay, yeah, we're right on top of each other already, so... That's definitely interesting. And Petra is up, up, up in the air. Let's take a look at the map here. Um, one we have to take out is right below us, which is nice. Who else do we see? Um, one hero, and we're not as scattered as I feared we would be. Frauke is in the worst place, but aside from that, we're actually okay, I think. And this should be Wordstone. Let's take it. Shard is definitely nice. And let's see if we can get Petra down there. Oh, that's two clusters there. Where is the one we need to kill? Is she just on the ground floor? 
I can't really see. But I assume she is, so let's jump down here. Yep, she's right in there. So we... I think I'm good to just go for this wordstone first. And I want to be able to get it all, so I need to move a little bit differently. Now I can get it all. Okay, nice. The debuffs might be bad, but I think we'll be good. I At least I hope. Let's check them once I've collected everything to see how much I screwed myself here. Because this is still a brutal mission, so there's at least some risk involved. And I can't dodge at the end of this. So let's see. We do have range resistance update, we lost leadership, uh, yeah, it's it's okay. It could be worse. Obviously we do want to strong blow, mm, that's unfortunate. Come on, please just hit with the second one. Okay, she dodged. Oh, they do start with dodge stance? Really? That's surprising. And apparently they do have two augers. Oh, hello. Where are you going? Oh, she's going for Varen. That's not nice. If I could hit something, that would be preferable. And we do have, we don't have the biggest luck with the initiative ladder. They have some high initiative guys as well. Well, they're heroes. But still. Let's see. Okay. Tunisia. That's a scavenge point. Um, we should still take a look, I think. Uh, blue Mandrake Root. I don't really care, but let's take it. I don't think we will have much opportunity to pick stuff up this this match. And let's see. What we definitely need to do is... First off, steal their idol. Because that's just good manners. They presented this to us quite nicely, so let's thank them and do the right thing here. And let's also take this Light Armor of Intelligence. Sure! And can we get her into the fight here? Yes, we can. Preferably without charging, but apparently not, so a charge it is. And I get to dodge stance for free because I've got Liberator's Boon. I keep forgetting that, but it's really, really nice. Let's see, I'm blocking myself here, so... That's a bit of a problem. Ada, uh, yeah, I would like to get her over there, but... I can't jump down here, and I can't go past her. I could climb up and try to get something going there, so let's try this. Um, and I'm here, so I need to jump over and down, I think. Or I could jump down this way. Either way, I probably won't get there, but this will at least get me down to the ground floor. And I'm actually surprised that I succeeded with the jump there. And let's go for an ambush right here. And we can get to her through this, uh, this doorway there, I hope. Oh, wow. Of course she already crits, but at least it's not a stun. So it's not that bad. Yeah, this is okay. Oh, she's scary. Where is she going? Yes, Miss Tunisa. You won't hit her. 
And I'm really happy that they're not engaging my smuggler with the with the weapon there. <laughs> um, but that means, oh, that's probably a trap. So let's try to not hit that. This will get very crowded in there very fast because obviously we'll move everyone over there and Ifa will be the first one in. Let's see, I get two attacks against this one. Barbara Siegrich. Two solid hits. Definitely a good thing and we still have enough for a dodge, so awesome. Oh, there comes another one. Oh yeah, Varen, Varen is in trouble. Oh, Varen will go down. I think it's very unlikely that this won't happen. Oh boy. Yeah, this is a bit of a problem here. Oh, sinful speech. Resist fail, so we can't cast spells. That's bad. Is she engaging our leader as well? No, she's going for sinful speech on Varen. She can't cast spells as well, so that's actually really a really strong move on her part. I didn't expect her to have that. Oh boy, they're doing all kinds of damage. Oh wow. Yeah, I really need to get the rest of the warband here. There are a lot of mine coming up, but they get to attack first. This should only get one attack. Yep. Okay, Varen, what can you do? Not a lot, actually. So you probably just need to attack this one. She's already been hit. But it looks very likely that she will go down. Yeah, that's the problem with the, the setup here. They had a lot of guys going first. Oh, yeah, that will take out the leader. Oh, thank you. Please, oh, befuddling fumes is good. So, not good for me. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, I really need to... to see if I can get to a better position here. And this actually looks pretty good. Yeah, but who do I want to shoot? Which one is this? Which one has one of them? Yeah, okay, this one is the one we need. So probably her. But I should probably try to shoot into the other combat. Can I shoot from up here? I can't. Let's go back down real quick and see if we can do this a little bit different. Okay, a 55% with the aim is actually okay. Oh yeah, I can't aim. Aim would be just this, but that's actually better, so let's try that. Big hit. Thank you. So, reload. And another aim. Oh, bay. Oh, boy. She succeeded her all alone test, which probably won't help her. Well, I can start by drinking the healing draught. It's unlikely to help me a lot, but at least I will try. And then let's start hitting on the one we actually need to take out for the objective. As unlikely as it is that we make it out of here alive. And parry, of course. But we, I might be able to turn this around.
but that all depends on who I want to help. I think I should try to move Vilda over this way and help out my leader. Yeah. Let's just hope that this will work. <laughs> okay, Frauke. Where is Frauke? Oh yeah, she's the one that is just on the wrong side of the battlefield. Can I get down out there? No, I can't get out there, so we need to go around. Uh, not the best thing. Zealous Corruption is okay. What does it do? Increase our initiative. That actually helps for the next turn. But I still can't really get there this turn. And that's a bit of a bummer. Let's see if I can make this move a little bit more efficiently. I definitely can. But I still have to wait at least one more round. Seraphim could actually do a lot here. Okay, I actually do have a line of sight on someone. I don't know on who. Um... Let's take a look here. Oh, really? I only have her? Why can't I go for the comet? No, I don't want to charge. I want to go for the comet. That's one. Nope, still not charging in. Let's go for another comet. And I need to cast more with her than I usually would like to, I think. Just to have the chance of taking her out. So I'm definitely going to take three casts. Oh, she resisted. And we've got fervor, so no more spell casting. I think. But we need to engage here just to make sure she's not completely lost there. Okay, and there's another one with a peg leg. At least she doesn't get into the fight this turn. A new round has started. And both their augurs are going first, so that's pretty bad. Yep, that's Varen down. I assumed as much. But this is manageable still. It could be a lot worse. But not hitting her is actually pretty bad. Okay, one hit. Better than nothing. And sidestep, of course. Let's see. Oh boy. And we still haven't seen all of them. That's terrifying. Yeah, she's hitting Petra, but as long as... She's not crit stunning her. It's not that bad. It's not that much damage. And I might actually just disengage and move Petra over here. Oh boy. They do dodge very well, which is really unfortunate. But at least she will have to, to test for all alone. And I can only hope that she will fail. But taking her out would be very valuable as well, I think. Where is she? We probably won't get there this turn, so we should focus on this, I think. That's the dodge gone. Okay, nice. So, probably two more turns of this. It's obviously not ideal. Oh, but this will help. And should make this a lot quicker, I hope. That might free these two up again next turn, if everything goes according to plan. And I really hope that it will. <laughs> 
Nice, she failed her all along. Dodge on Eva, perfect. That's one hit. Okay. Yeah, our leader is in the biggest trouble here, obviously, but... Okay, Sigma's second win should give offense points for counterattack, I think. Oh, Wrath? Um, ow. But we're heavy armored, and as long as she's attacking Vilda and not my leader, I'm okay with it. Okay, she's taunted her, so she can't disengage as easily. A miss is perfect. Oh boy, yeah. This might be it for her. Another taunt, probably won't do anything, and that's an out of action. Okay, yeah, that's pretty bad. Let's start things off with a reload. And an aim on her. If we hit her, she's down. Nice, thank you. Let's reload again. And we don't have another shot here. So let's just overwatch, I think, because I can't move anymore. That's a bit unfortunate. But I like the damage she's doing. It's definitely very nice. Okay. Yeah, it's really unfortunate that they were able to just gang up on two of mine and take them out like that. And Varen was just very weak because she's just level two or three. So she's not the strongest one to begin with. But, oh, really? Wow. That's unfortunate. Well, let's see. That's a miss, and she can't attack anymore. Oh, okay, she's level 8, so she can after charging. Okay, let's see. Is a comet a good thing here? Probably? On her? Yeah, I think. At least one. And she resisted, of course. Let's try that one more time. Okay, this time we did make this work. And let's attack her once. Seraphim, you can do this. A new round has started. Yeah, you need to check for all alone real soon. Oh boy, but they still have two sisters left that need to come to us. Okay, the one auger was back here, and we haven't seen their their sisters. No, their their Sigma's purifier at all. Okay, yeah, she's almost she is down, so we need to loot her. Um, nice! Really nice crit. Come on. Okay, she's not down, but close. Come on. If Petra hits both her attacks, this one will be gone. And actually, a normal one will be just enough. Okay, bye-bye. And I think I need to loot you. Do I? Yeah, but let's let's Ada do that. Yep. She should have the room. So just to make sure that she can get there as well, let's put her let's give her for Sigma. And then run like the wind. One more turn before we can get Petra in. Objectives updated. But Ada Objective maybe can get complete. there with you for Sigma buff this turn already. Yes, she can, so... Bye-bye, Sigma... Bye-bye, uh, you know what I mean. Okay, and we can... 
Well, let's not loot with her. I would rather engage here, I think. Oh boy, nice, really good. Wow. No dodging, unfortunately, but... She might be forced to check for all alone again, I think. She's engaged with two of them alone, so that should force her. If I understand the mechanic correctly, which I hope that I do by now. Okay, she doesn't, so apparently I don't. <laughs> but she's also not hitting anything, so... That's good. Yeah, taunt I don't really care about. Sinful speech I do care about, and we resist the... F we fail to resist again. So Seraphim can't cast any spells, but she does a lot of damage in melee as well. So it's still okay, I think. I hope. I assume. That these two can move freely now and engage somewhere is really bad. Let's see. Okay, she just goes on Vilda. That's okay. Um, that will force an all alone, which isn't good, but... We can do something about that. Okay, she's actually looting Isolde. We need to get that back. Because there was a good hammer in there, I think. Yeah, yeah. Just taunt, miss, and... Another miss? Nope. And let's see. You... Can't get the high ground. On these guys or can you um, can I get a yeah okay so this aim would be oh against her back there that's interesting I can deal with this I think that will make things easier back there I would like to help out on the left side here, but if I can't, I can't, so let's just try to take her out back there. And yeah, why not go for an impact shot? Please hit. Okay, awesome, she's down. And yeah, why not go for perception? Hey, success, there's enemies around. Okay, Eva, not engaged right now. I don't need her tome, do I? Um, nope, I need hers. But Eva probably is not the one to get it. Because I want Eva on her. Because we still need to take her out. Nice dodge fail. And we should have enough for our sidestep. Yes. Awesome. Okay. This is fine at the moment. We succeeded our all-alone test. Perfect. Of course we will attack Eloise. And whittle her down, slowly but surely. She is the last one, I think, we need. If I'm not completely mistaken. Okay, Seraphim. Seraphim can not float around, but loot... Hers. Objectives yep, that was the correct Objective one. Completed. And since they don't want her casting, I will gladly oblige and just go into combat. Hello. Oh boy, that's a stun. Nice. So she's down. Let's loot hers as well. Objective completed. And it was their leader that looted us, wasn't it? I... oh god, I don't remember. That's a problem. Um, I think it was, so... 
Or was it? Ah, uh, that's too bad. I can't. Re I really can't remember. And I can't attack anymore. Okay, parry. Thank you. That's a counter attack. Yeah, that's nothing. <laughs> a new round has started. Let's see. We still haven't seen two of them, which is our luck, obviously. But they are close to routing. They are sisters, though, so they will probably just succeed their first route check. At least there is a definite possibility that this will happen. Um, I want... Okay, I can't get Petra on there, so... How much damage does a charge do? More than a heavy... Blow? I assume not. Well, it's similar. And that's still quite a bit of damage. <laughs> Health-wise, we're fine with her. Okay, we do have all three right now. I can't engage their leader, so let's just keep piling on to this one. Nice crit. Come on. Okay, yeah, we lost two ourselves, but now things are looking okay again. I assume we won't lose any more. At least we shouldn't. Okay, she's going to counterattack. And it could have gone a lot better, obviously, but with the deployment that was part of this mission, I think we can still be happy with the results. Or at least content. <laughs> okay, yeah, she's fine there on her own. Won't really matter. I'd rather focus my attacks, if possible. Because one of these twos has has Isolde's equipment, and I would really like to find out who. Oh boy, but she does have a lot of life. I assume I can't kill her this turn. Well, no, most likely not. She succeeded her all alone. I don't really care about taunts, to be honest. I don't want to get disengage here. I have two high, uh, two heavy hitters on her, so why disengage? She failed, though, which is extremely valuable. Okay, first of all, first off, she needs to reload. Her shot is extremely bad, though. I will get a 54% aim. I think that's the best I can ask for. Um, can I try that again? No, I can just go for a normal shot. Um, let's just try. I, it doesn't really hurt. Okay, too bad. And... You know what, let's not take her out yet, or attack her more. Petra will do this all by herself, so we should rather try to deal some damage to the leader here. Okay. Varen back in action. Uh, Seraphim. Formerly known as Varen. Nice stun. Oh, can I actually get her? It's still a bit unlikely, but I might. Let's go for a comet here. Yeah, sure. I can cast again. Your sinful speech is over. Oh, she's so close. But it's not quite enough, unfortunately. Oh, well. Let's just dodge. 
Yeah, and these two can pretty much uh, whack at each other all match if they want. Both are in heavy armor with a shield. <laughs> They're not going anywhere. The round has started. Oh, where will we see the auger now? The other one. Yeah, there she comes. And I did get at least a little bit of words down here. So, that's nice. If I get the opportunity, I might want to run for more this turn. But we'll see. Let's start off with a strong blow. Because now they are below routing, so they might just fail. But I can check now. Okay, she's got Isolde's stuff, but just that, so they just looted her her tome, apparently. And that's it. And I would really like to run for that cluster back there. But she's full, and I would have to drink the healing draft. And that would leave me with not enough movement to get there. So not the best option, but I have an idea. Let's check. Who's up next in initiative? That should be... Well, where's 62? Yeah, okay, it's Tunisia, but she's full herself, so she can't. Let's assume that they succeed with their route test. Then Ada would be next. And because of that, let's give her for Sigma. And with the rest... Oh, wow, that's quite the reach on the ambush there. I wanted to attack her myself, so it's okay. But that's really quite the reach on the ambush. Oh, wow. That's an open wound. That's unfortunate. Okay, yeah, Tunisia is full with her backpack. I can't engage on her, so let's deal with this auger as well. Just in case. If you didn't watch, if you do not watch my deadly challenge mission, I uh, missions or plays, I had a game against Sisters of Sigmar, and I think they. Oh, wow, she's just critting away. Oh boy, but they failed their route test. Okay, we got the optional objective. We got oh four clusters, six shards, and three fragments. Two were taken out, and we should have two more open wounds, so four injuries in total. That's not that good, but... The faithful need never fear Let's just hope that Sigma's nothing bad happens from this. Them. Let's see. And I'm actually not sure about the smuggler yet, but I couldn't really try her out that much this turn. Oh, what? Isolde's just straight up dead. Oh, wow. <laughs> really? <laughs> nice. Oh, boy. Another one bites the dust. Yeah. But she did her job, and she did it well, so... Nice. Okay. Light wounds on Is Petra. That's fine. Fantastic. Seraphim leveled up. Awesome. Varen got a severed arm. That's unfortunate because it will reduce her capabilities for close combat and also allow her only to wear one Sigma Red Hammer, but it does give her 20% dodge, so I can... It's it's a, it's it's a not that bad. It could be a lot worse, definitely. I can live with that. Okay, Frauke, Wilda... Okay. Nice progress. Okay, Tunisia leveled up as well. That's really good. Nice progress. Yeah, a lot of level ups this one in this one. That's really really good. And also two new formulas, and I got the light armor of intelligence here, which sounds like something for Seraphim. Formula of innovation and apprentices. Uh, let's. Hope that I can find out who they belong to. Uh, pay treatment. I might just send this off here. Let's pay upkeep. 
Do I have a leader here? Yes, I do. But she would be very expensive to get. 1192 gold is definitely nothing to to scoff at. Oh boy. Yeah, this is This is really unfortunate. Let's take a look here. We have not that big of a bonus right now. How much could we get if we really meant to? So we could go to up to 925 gold, but if we then bought the leader, that would leave us pretty much wiped out. So I'm not in love with the idea. And I think we really don't have another choice but to just get a level rank zero leader, as risky as that is. Kete von Katz, grand, grand name. <laughs> yeah, but welcome. Let's hope you survive longer than your predecessor. And let's just outfit her right away. Um, yeah, probably just a... Mm, yeah, just a mace to make her hit better. And aside from that, not much to do. A little bit of customization. Um, which preset was the right one here? I think this one looks looks fine okay let's take a quick look here seraphim you're wearing purple armor right now so that's nice and that would give you plus two intelligence and max intelligence which is extremely valuable but would cost you a bit of armor absorption i think i can live with that with the because you she will deal more damage yeah I like this. Okay, so who can I give the the purple armor to? What is she wearing? She's wearing cloth. Do I want to go for purple light armor on her? I don't think so. Mm, it might be a good choice on Varen. I assume she's wearing blue one right now. Yep. But she's also injured for quite some time, so it's not that important yet. That's purple light armor. That's blue light armor, but she needs to pause as well, and we can get Narondia back in. So yeah, I will switch equipment around a little bit and make sure that we have um, some healthy members. Um, but as far as I can tell, yeah, we need to advance two days. I don't have the room to get another henchman and two of them are injured. Well, I might just leave one out. That No, I can't. I don't have the reserve slot for it. So yes, I actually don't have another choice. Market stock has been replenished. Oh, I already. It's been that long that I've forgotten that I already sent a a, a, um, a shipment here. Let's check the shop for new items. Okay, new purple clothing. That's nice. What else? Nothing too much of note. Okay, and that actually would have allowed me to get the level three. Um one do I will st do I still want to do this maybe I could just fire her again oh that's the big question here oh I'm at eight of you know what I will try it out with her it's it's a bit, bit of risk but I'm willing to take that one Okay, so everyone except Varen is back up to good health. So we need to switch her out. But, well, I don't know how I'm going to set up the 
how I'm going to set up here. And I probably should have used the time to get a skill. I forgot about that again. So that's dumb. But that's also me. So live with it or something like that. <laughs> no, sorry. You know what I mean. I'm just... I forgot about it. It was an honest mistake. <laughs> yeah, but... That's it for today then. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a comment. And if you want to see me play more and more time, just subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. And as always, thanks for watching. I hope that you tune in next time and have a nice day. Bye.